Hi there curious minds. In this marketing session we will delve deeper into the topic of research instrument. Let's get learning. So, what is a research instrument? A research instrument is essentially a tool that researchers use for collecting and analyzing data. Think of it as a bridge that connects us to the information we need. Without these instruments, we would be unable to access, gather, or understand data effectively. There is a wide variety of research instruments to choose from, each with its own strengths. Some of the most commonly used research instruments are interviews, surveys, observations, focus groups, and secondary data. Let's briefly understand these. Interviews and surveys often involve directly asking participants about their experiences, opinions, or behaviors. Observations, on the other hand, involve studying people in their natural settings. Focus groups are a form of group interview that capitalizes on the communication between research participants in order to generate data. Secondary data, meanwhile, involves analyzing data that was collected by someone else or for some other purpose. Now, designing research instruments is not as simple as it might seem. There are several key factors a researcher needs to consider to ensure the research's success. These include the validity and reliability of the results, their applicability, and the generalizability of the findings. Validity refers to whether the instrument measures what it is supposed to measure. Reliability asks the question, if we were to conduct the study again, would we get the same results? Applicability relates to whether the results are useful and relevant to the real world, and generalizability asks whether the findings can be applied to a larger population. Let's dive a little deeper into some specific research instruments used primarily in quantitative research, such as, telephone interviews, face-to-face -face interviews, surveys. These methods are widely used due to their ability to reach a larger audience, the speed of data collection, and the potential for more objective, statistically significant results. Lastly, let's take a look at questionnaires. Questionnaires can either be self-administered or completed with the researcher's interference. A self-administered questionnaire is filled out by the respondent themselves, allowing for privacy and potentially more honest responses. On the other hand, questionnaires with researcher interference, where the researcher is present while the respondent fills out the questionnaire, allow for clarification of questions and can ensure a higher response rate. Remember, choosing the right research instrument is critical to your research project. It directly influences the type and quality of data you collect, which in turn impacts your findings and conclusions. Choose wisely, and you'll be on the road to uncovering meaningful, actionable insights. That wraps up our session. Remember, each day brings new learning opportunities. Until next time, stay curious.